Hi. Good day to everyone. My name is Jim, founder of JT Techcrunch and Amber Hub. We are the LD Display Design Manufacturing House. In front of us, this is a RS232 LD Display Panel. Where you can see on the left hand side, it's a 4 row with 16 character each row. So the character size of each of the character is 70 mm. So you can see the M1 Malaysia 0, 0 08, K4 Kuala Lumpur 187. So on the Selangor and Cheras. So let's start our presentation today. This is the display that actually we programmed halfway. So let's off the display. So once you off and you on back, and this is the default setting. So we can see the first line is ID 001, and the second line is ID 002, third line ID 003, and followed by fourth line ID 004. So I try to differentiate by putting the Castronic.com. So let's start our presentation. So you can see that uh, basically uh, before that, I have basically you can see on the right hand side here, I have programmed a few of the function over here. So let's see. So the first one I will be showing the ID 001. So it won't be have any difference. So let's try this one ID 002. Copy and I paste to this hyper terminal so and start and this is so this is the and send so now become ID 002 so you can see the difference so uh, one is without space and one is with space so let's go to ID number 3 okay then this one I actually I just ignore it go to ID 004 so I copy this one basically I do I put the minute here paste then it's send so now become ID 004 and this is how the display looks like so afterward let's say that I want to put the ID 001 with castroni.com so the address have to start with our own protocol 001 display castronic.com this is our instruction so copy I convert it into hex file because it's easier for us to take a look so you also can put it into husky so now is castronic.com so I have pre-programmed ID 002 assembly line number 9 with a special character so I just copy delete then go to send so now it's assembly line number 9 so this is how it looks like so then I go to ID 003. So I show maintenance call. So I copy again. This hexa decimal code. Highlight over here. Delete. Paste the instruction here. And send. So now it's maintenance call. So we can see the response is quite real time. Once you send, the other side will receive. So the last one will be 004. I will put the model number of the display. So copy and paste. So send. So now it's 3.2 RW I232 ASCII. So this is how it looks like. So for instance, now I want to just empty the castronic.com. Actually, you can see a lot of space spacing over here. So Copy and send. So you can see that the first line is seen. So basically, I empty the display. So now, number two. Okay. 
okay and send so number two missing so let's go to number three so i just want to empty the display to show you all how this looks like so empty okay number three the last one zero zero four so empty and this is how it looks like so the display of width of the display for this is three feet times one feet so the actual size is 1010mm times 370mm with the depth of 80mm so let's start with the next one command so now i want the first line appear 001 dis okay m1 malaysia m1 space malaysia 008 so we'll copy and send so now you can see m1 malaysia the next one will be address number two so k4 kuala lumpur So imagine that this can be the flight information or the stock market exchange display also. So S7 Selangor, the last one will be Teras, C4 Teras, so let's see. So now you can see the display basically is the four for the terrace one is 3.82. So now I want to put 3.83. So of course uh, when you have automate this basically you just plug on the from the library. So send you will see that okay 83 next one eight four and the last one The response is almost 0 0.7 millisecond. Once I press, it will receive and display. So this is how it looks like for the RS232485 display. So if you like my video, please leave a comment, like and share. My name is Jim. Thank you for watching and have a nice day.